They're Americans. You're gay. Gay. Native Americans is gay. I'm a half Native American. Man. Half. Your father? What's your father? That's my mother. What's your father? My father was German. My mother was Dakota. German? Okay. It goes by your father. Whatever your father is. I don't know. Could be. I don't know. I'm mixed. You could be. I mean, Israel, these people are scattered all over the world, so I don't know. If your spirit, if your spirit goes with the spirit of these scriptures, then yeah, you're Israelite. I read every single thing on religion. I read everything, and it's all about the spiritual thing, really. Okay. Honestly, it's not against whites, it's not against blacks, it's not against any color whatsoever. It ain't about color, it's about race. No, no not even race. It is about race. No, it's no, there's no race. It is race. There is no race. You know what the word race mean? Right. Is you race know. a color or is it an ethnicity? Is, the, is the ethnicity a color? No. Back in the day, the Old Testament stated... Give me Deuteronomy chapter 4, man. Temple. Yeah, not the most high God choose a chosen people? Yeah, yeah, yeah. A people is a what? So if God chose the chosen people, if God chose the chosen people, it's about race then. You said Judas what? Snitch. Judas. He told on Jesus for a couple 30 pieces of Judas. Judas, that's the tribe of Judah. No, Judah, Judah, he, he, he's No, not Judah. He told on Jesus. No, Judas told on Jesus. No, he told on Jesus for three pieces of silver. Okay. You got Judah and you got Judas. These two different people. Let me do Deuteronomy, man. Deuteronomy 4 and... Uh, Deuteronomy 6. 6. And 6. Deuteronomy 7 and 6. What's that? W.A. Pop. W.A. Pop. Yeah. What's that mean? W.A. Pop. Deuteronomy 7 verse 6. Jamaicans. Go ahead. Oh, you kill him. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy God. Read that again. For thou art an holy people unto the Lord thy power. If you're a people, that's a race or ethnic group. Right. The Israelites were of a man named Israel or Jacob, which means he's a race. It is a race. It is a race. What do you mean by there's no race? There's no race. Explain that. We are all children of God. No, we're not. There's one people called the children of God. No, no, no. The devil. Where is you the going? Devil gets in us. You going by the Bible or you going by some other book or some what you believe? Oh my one, I believe. I thought he okay, came well, you. we can't. We hey, go yo, by the Bible. Yo, that's my brother right here. Hey, yo. All right, so go ahead. Let's. No, let's tell me. Right. Listen, listen. For thou art an holy people. Right Unto here. the Lord thy power, the Lord thy God hath chosen thee to be a special people unto himself above all people that are upon the face of the earth. Right, so the, the Most High is speaking of races, man. All right? Give me Amos chapter 4, man. What I'm trying to say is there is no race. We're all brothers. There is a race. There are races. There are. No, no. There's races, yes. There's people that hate people, yes. No, not racist. There's races. There's races. But it don't call, go by color. Only one God. Yeah, it's only one God, and he created different races on the earth, just like there's different species of animals. Are all the animals the same? There's different species. You got alligators, you got fucking... Right, but there's different species of animals. So there's different races of men, just the same. Yeah, yeah, I appreciate what y'all doing right here, man. Okay. Trying to get the word out. All right. There is no such thing as like Well, in the Bible it is. That's what we go by. So, you know. What about me and woman? What about me and woman? Huh? What about me and woman? King James 16:11. King James? Yeah. Yeah. I'll read that one too. Okay. Well, in that Bible, it's racist. No, there is no racism in there, man. There's races. There's yeah, you're right. Exactly. Racism. Jews kill Jews. Jews kill Jesus. 
the Jews didn't kill Jesus. Certain, certain of the Jews killed Jesus, but not all the Jews. Yeah, so. I like that. Yeah, I got like a lot. I don't know. I don't know what they call my dog over here, man. Y'all got like everybody over here. Go back, Revelation 14. Wow. Man, you're the guys that do not agree with the guys that come around with. Um, Red and white? Yeah. Yeah, nobody agrees with them. <laughs> <laughs> Like it's that white guy. Like it's that white man. <laughs> hey, we well. Hey, That's man. the guys I'm talking about, man. I know you're you're like them. Don't you? We're not you're them. Like, we don't like Esau like either, though. Come around, you know, they come in robes and stuff, man. Come on. We don't like Esau either. <laughs> hey, but they are going into slavery. So-called white man. Hey, you know that? Hey, I'm homeless. I'm half white. Why I ain't got that? <laughs> what? Why you not going to slavery? No, no, what no. you mean? Why I ain't got a big ass house? Why I ain't got a big ass ride? Why Maybe you might be Israel. I don't know. No, Maybe German, your time is. German, I've never heard. That's all right. They had Israelites in Germany. Don't you know black black people ruled Europe? Do you know that? You know the people, the people, Israel, the Israelites that they were in Germany and Russia and all these different places. Okay, so hey, you could be Israel. I don't know. It did. If you Israel, it did, yeah. If you were Israel, who would he say? Who would he say anyone? Huh? Who would he say anyone? Well, the most I know your spirit. He know what spirit you got. If you're an Israelite or if you're a heathen. Right. Honestly, the most I do is to say. Honestly, I thought you all was the anti-white people. Oh That's well. Why I came here to we're not anti-white, but we we anti-Esau. Anti-Edomite. Yeah. Know, y'all should be pro brothers. No, no, we're not. No, because bro every brothers. Bro brothers. Everybody's a brother. Everybody's not a brother. Exactly. Everybody's not brothers. Everybody. Everybody's you know a the, brother and a sister in the eyes of the world. Don't you know that the most I divided different nations on this earth? Give me Sirach chapter um 17, verse 17. So but you know when the Most High created, when God created people on the earth, He divided them according to races. Yeah, because uh, we saw the uh, Temple of Zion. No, you talking about the Babel? Temple? You talking about Babel? But that shows you that the Most High God didn't want all races to come together as brothers. That's the aim of the heathens. The heathens telling you that, but they because they since, since the Tower of Babel, going back to when you read the Book of Maccabees. They always want to have this one world order, this this one world unity of all nations, but the Most High don't want it like that. Read brother. this. You got a brother? Yeah, read that. Uh, Surat 17, verse 17. For in the division... For in the, 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 the division of the nations of the whole earth, he said a ruler over every people, but Israel is the Lord's portion. Read that again. For in the division of... Wait. In the what? In the division. In the division. When the Most High divided the people of the earth. Division. Division. And then he did what? Of the nations. Not addition. And did what? For in the, the, the division of the nations of the whole earth, he set a ruler over every people. He divided the people and set up rulers over them because he didn't want them together. Just the same as... No, he didn't create confusion. The Lord is not the author of confusion. That's just the way he wanted it. Just like when you look in the animal kingdom, you don't have all, even, you, when you look at the animal kingdom, such as lions, or look, let's look at ants. Ants have their own little so empires, looking, man. man. Okay? One ant, one ant, one little ant power gonna go to war with the next ant power because they're different. They're divided. Right. But the Most High God divided man in the same manner because he has a certain order that he wants. Go ahead, read that again. For in the division of the nations of the whole earth, he said a ruler over every people, but Israel is the Lord's portion. Go ahead. Whom being his firstborn, he nourishes with discipline, and giving him the light of his love, doth not forsake him. Right, Israel is chosen people. Now go to Sirach 33 and 10. All right. The Most High divided the sons of men. 
And there was a reason for that. See, the Mosai does things for a reason. The, the children of Israel. Huh? The Lord did that for a reason. He did it for a reason when he divided the he children divided. of men. I know why. Yeah. Because the, the Israelites are supposed to be the rulers of this earth to teach all the other nations at a certain time love. how to keep. No, it's not about love. It's about how to follow the Most High, worship Him, and keep His laws. You gotta love. That's not what it's about. No, you gotta love. That's not what it's you about. Gotta love, you gotta love, you gotta forget. That's love spirit, okay. right, man. You gotta get rid of that. That's, a, that's what the heathens are teaching, man. No, no, no. New Testament teaches. What is love? Let's get that. Give me, give me the book of. You know, love is. Second John, man. You know, love is. Love is. I'll throw myself in front of a bullet for you. Huh? Love is. I'll throw myself in front of a bullet for you. Wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Because you're my brother. Wait, hold on. You're my brother. You're a Christian guy. Don't have fun with that. Wait, hold on. Now. Let me get that. Okay. I want second John, man. Two school teachers. First, verse um six. The second John two verse six. And this is love that we walk after his commandments. What is the commandments? Because this said it says this is love. That we walk after his commandments. If you really want to know what love is, that's love. Like I said. So what is it? Love. What is love? Passion. I don't want to see you do no wrong. I don't want me to do no wrong. Well, what's wrong? What's wrong is doing something wrong to your fellow man. Like what? Give me an example. Give me an example? Like, yeah, like this is why I walked up and y'all tell me to get the fuck away. That's wrong. Well, it's not wrong. No, y'all told me to get the fuck away. Well, up. it might have been a reason. Like the people in the robes. Okay, well, let's break that's it down. Based on hate. That's the most problem. Go ahead. Read that again. And this is love that we walk after his commandments. This is the commandment that as ye have heard from the beginning, ye should walk in it. Now, give me Leviticus chapter 19, verse 15. Let's find out what love really is. It said the commandments. The commandments are what? The commandments is what? The law, statutes, and commandments. 1611. Would you say like, okay, say this. If a homosexual... I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry but... Um, say it. My great-grandfather built a church from the ground up. Let me ask you a question real quick. You just did gluttony. You just did gluttony. What? This look fucking... at woman. Look at women. I didn't even fuck. I didn't even look at her. What? Oh, no. I didn't even look at her. T -t -t Which one? Which one? I don't know. I guess you're talking about them two women right there. What's wrong with hey, looking at them? Yeah, I could look at them anyways. Do you know what gluttony means? That's, sin. That's, sin. Sin. Oh. That's not a sin. Oh. Hey, guys. Oh. What law is it? You want to do that Babylon thing, just making up, making up laws, man, just because. Gluttony is gluttony. Just say you thou should not look at a woman. Bro. Okay, why are you saying that? That's the end. They say don't look at a woman. But gluttony I'm has not. Gluttony. You said that's gluttony. I wasn't even looking at her, man. I was so in tune with breaking this down. I looked at it when you mentioned it, cause I'm wondering what you're talking about. But let's keep going, man. First, um, Leviticus. Leviticus 19 and 15, what love is? Uh, Leviticus 19 and 15. Right. Ye shall do no unrighteousness in judgment. Thou shalt not respect the person the poor, nor honor the person the mighty. But in righteousness shalt thou judge thy neighbor. Keep going. Thou shalt not go up and down as a talebearer among thy people. Neither shalt thou stand against the blood of thy neighbor. I am the Lord. Thou shalt not hate thy brother in thine heart. Can you read that I again? That. I love that. Thou shalt not go up. No, thou shalt not hate thy brother in heart. Exactly. It's thou shalt not hate thy brother in thine heart. Now what is what is the opposite of hate? It's love, right? So you should love your brother, right? Okay, now keep reading. Find out what love is. Keep reading. Thou shalt not hate the brother in thy heart. Right. Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor. You read that again? Rebuke. Thy neighbor. 
Thou shalt in any wise rebuke thy neighbor. A neighbor. And not suffer sin upon him. Now what is sin? Because it said, it's telling you that love is rebuking your neighbor when he sins. Yeah, sin defined in the Bible is really take from each other. But basically, the reason why I came in here and messaged y'all is to make sure y'all weren't the racist one of us. We are racist, though. If you look at no, the true sense of it, we, we are racist. No, if mean, you hating other races. We are, no, the word racist means for your race. I mean, y'all, right? y'all, y'all are cool. Listen, the word racist, the word racist means for your people. All right, does a scientist mean that you hate science? Yeah, scientists. Does a scientist mean that you hate science? No, I love science. What does it mean? What is a scientist? A scientist, scientist breaks shit down. It's a person that studies science, right? I uh, don't know. No, because we're trying to get you to understand suffixes. A suffix. No, I'm trying to get you to understand a suffix. A suffix. Trying to understand Jesus in your point of view. Listen, a suffix is any word on the end of a word, like science. Scientist is two words, science and ist. Science means a person that deals in truth or. What we call God science today, an ist God means a person that's for God something. Listen, you got to listen. If you want to learn, you got to listen. Science means a person that deals with science or observation of truth. Ist means somebody that's for it or in it. So if you're a race, ist means you're a race for certain people, you're with a certain people, or stop, and ist meaning you're for it. You don't hate white folks, you don't hate from you don't hate you don't hate nobody. The most I hate you. Did you know that? Huh? Did you know that the most I hate is certain people? I don't care. <laughs> but I, did you I know love. that? I don't, I don't care because I got love. No, you don't okay. care what the most I does, right? No, I don't care. Okay. Alright, well, what is it? I don't care. Listen, you call, you call, you call yourself it. whatever you want to be. I feel you. Well, honestly, we, we worship not. the same God, right? Check it out, check it out. Honestly, God. The God. The God. We're we wasting our time, man. You, you, you said you don't care. Yeah, I don't care. All right, just what you have, Revelation 13? Yeah, Revelation 14. Oh, Revelation 13. Oh, I love that one. I love that one. I love Revelation. Glad you said that, man. Yeah, I don't cut care. Up. I don't care. You're cut up now, man. Because we're all the same. Revelation 14. God created us all, right? Give me, give me Malachi 1. Did, did, did God create us all? But the most I hate certain people. Yeah, no, no. That's to say devil. that you devil. to say that you don't hate people or hate things is, is to lie. That's a lie. No, no, no. Those things I disagree with. Do you know what the word hate means? It's a strong dislike for something. Exactly. Don't you dislike things? I dislike people. They're like racist. Like KKK. That's, uh, that's uh, Babylon uh, philosophy. Like Panther motherfuckers from going on that shit. No. Go ahead. Read me that. From the card four. Chapter one, one and four. four. This is Malachi one verse four. And then Revelation thirteen and nine. Whereas Edom said, "We are impoverished." Right, fourteen and two. Go ahead. But we will return and build the desolate places. Edom, you know what Edom is? That's the so-called white man. Not all white people, but the so-called white man. No, no, it's the world. So-called white man is Edom. It's the world, not white people, not black people. It's the world. No telling you what it is, man. You got to listen. If you don't want to listen, not white, not here, black, that's nothing, man. It's if you don't want to listen, well then, the you, well then you should go teach, man. You shouldn't be world, telling man. us. It's the world. It's not. It's hey, not. You know, you, dude, what am I? I don't white. know what you are, I'm man. Mixed. Okay. That's the world. It's not. Edom is a race of people. Edom is just like Israel is a race of people. And then, hey, boy, people, they're the ones first to go in the fucking lakes of hell. Okay, well why you don't teach that, man? Go teach, you should teach one of these people around well, I here, I think man. I'm here. You're not teaching us? Cause we I are- making sure you shoot. <laughs> no, we know the truth. We trying to teach you, but you- I'm the fucking people on uh, fucking red and white fucking what I hear. Yeah, but them people was telling you some things they was oh, telling you was me, true. Like, uh, um, Fuck Whitey. <laughs> Some of the things they were telling you were true. No. Yeah, the no, so-called no, white. No, you know no, the so-called no, white no, man going no, to slavery? No, no, no. 
Do you know that? America and everything else, you know, okay, slavery, whatever, it happened, it'd be gone. It happened, okay? It happened. It's like I'm half Native American Dakota Sioux. You know what white people right. did to me? And my people, they killed us. Alright, so what's our conclusion then? Our conclusion is, I, I love you. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Okay, continue, please. But thanks, man. We, we're going to keep reading, but we're not going to really, we're not going to focus with dealing with you anymore. Because you've been incoherent, man. Incoherent? Why? Yeah, I love like you. Fool, man. You, you're not listening, I'm saying, man. You know, this is going fool scriptures, man. What the world? You're not listening, man. We're what here to world? teach. We're not here to, we're not oh, here okay, so to listen. Much. We're here to teach. We're trying to teach, we're trying to teach you who you are and what this thing is about, but you're not listening. I am listening. No, you're talking. So we can't teach you, so it's pointless. We tried, you know, to dap you up. All right, man. Well, take it easy, man. Oh, I guess I gotta go. He don't want to dap you up, man. Dap you up, man. You ain't showing me no respect. I do. You're not even listening, man. The brother's trying listen. to break down the scriptures, and you're not even listening, man. I'm supposed to dap you up, man. Yeah, that scripture, man. Uh, Bro, what you so had, uh, man, man, That's why the scripture said, man, he that is wicked, man, let him oh, be wicked wait, still. Lord, man. Lord. See, he a demon, man. So I was trying to tell you, what? he's a demon, man. Yeah, I don't know. He's trying to get him to fucking leave. Go ahead, uh. <laughs> well, well, go right, Revelations 14 and 9. Bunch of time wasting, man. Yeah, it's now I know why your Howard style was really like, yo, cut throat with these niggas, man. Like, yo, fuck about what, what all these other motherfuckers are saying, man. We just gonna do what we gotta do, man. Let's get on, matter of fact. Motherfuckers waste time, man. Let's go we back. just reading that vanity, man. Let's they, go back. Give me songs. That motherfucker, you can't one. tell me he wasn't made Proverbs in vain, one. man. Yeah, yeah. Proverbs one and twenty, man. Yeah, man, we out here to teach. We're not out here to listen, man. We out here to teach Israel. We already know the truth, man. All right, we we already we already we've already listened. That's stupid. We out here in garments just to come out here to listen. Right. We out here with Bibles, signs, garments. We know the scriptures. We know the scriptures. We learned. We spent all this time learning the scriptures just so we could come out here. And learn from a bunch of motherfuckers that don't know nothing. Drunk and shit like that. Being drunk. Just talking from their heart. Go ahead, you got that? Yeah. What I asked for. Yeah, give, give me that. Go ahead. This is uh, Proverbs 1 to 20. Wisdom crieth without. She uttereth her voice in the streets. Right. She crieth in the chief place of concourse. You got it. Read, read that again. Start over. Wisdom crieth without. Wisdom crieth without. Wisdom crieth without. That's why scriptures tell us to lift up our voice as uh, like, a, uh, like a trumpet, man. Wisdom is crying out. We're crying out to the people, man. With wisdom. Keep going. She uttered her voice in the streets. She said she uttered her, her voice in the streets. Because wisdom is likened to a woman, man. She said she uttered her voice in the streets. Where we at? Street to church in Orange Street, man. That's what's going on. What's going on? She cried from the chief place of concourse. Chief place of concourse. This is definitely a chief place of concourse right here. This is where all the people at. Whether they buying, selling, you know, going out, having a good time, where everybody's passing this spot right here, man. And you know the, you know the reason why it says that? It's because this is this is so you don't have a fucking excuse to say you ain't never hear this, man. Oh man, I would have listened to the Israelites, but they were somewhere in a, a dark alley, so I, didn't, I couldn't, I couldn't uh, hear what they was talking about. Now this is Psalms 57 and 4. It says, "Thou hast given a banner to them that fear thee, that it may be displayed because of the truth." Right. So it's out here, man. Again, please. Psalms chapter 59, verse 4. I'm sorry, Psalms chapter 60, verse 4. 
Thou hast given a banner to them that fear thee, that it may dis that it may be displayed because of the truth. That it may be displayed because of the truth, man. This is all for the truth. You can't say you you can't you you, you can't see his banner, man. It's for the truth, man. You can't you can't say that you ain't come across and see the Israelites, man. We out here every week. He going out. She cried from the chief place of concourse in the openings of the gates. In the city she uttereth her words, saying, How long ye simple ones? How long ye simple ones? Will ye love simplicity? Will ye love simplicity, man? How long would you read that again, please? How long ye simple ones will ye love simplicity? How long will ye simple ones love simplicity, man? What is that basically saying? How long would you stupid ones love st stupidness, man? Because they're simple. We got a scripture too for you. Go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, this is uh. That's Proverbs you reading? Yeah, yeah, Proverbs. First chapter, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, keep going with that though. Go ahead. This Psalms chapter 31, verse 6. I have hated them that regard lying vanities, but I trust in the Lord. I have hated them that are like God vanities, man. We ain't out here on for vanity, man. We out here with the wisdom. That's why we, like the scripture said, we despise y'all, man. Out here that's, that's, that's in vanity and shit, man. That regard, like, like that guy. That guy regards the blind vanity, man. That's why I was just trying to tell him that that's everything he was spewing out was the philosophies of the heathen. And it's funny because, man, all praise y'all, but she may shy. It's funny because it said, give me Revelation 13 one more time. We're going to come back. What you doing? Revelation 13, man. I thought she knew you, man. I feel like they have like, no. Yeah, please. It said, uh... Go ahead, man. Revelation 13, man. Uh, Revelation 13, uh... Sure. 13. Yeah, the chip. <laughs> you have that word, the image. Uh, we're 13 and 16. And he caused of all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and bond, to receive a mark in the right hand or in the foreheads. And that no man might buy or sell, save he that had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. Here's, here's wisdom. It says something about worship, the beast, man. The, beast. the image of the beast, man. Verse 15. And he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak, and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Right now, that's what this guy caught up in, man. All the philosophies of, of Babylon talking about some fucking love, man. If you read the book of um, Maccabees, it tells you the same thing. They was talking about put away, remember they told us to put away our law, statutes, and commandments. Get that? Huh? Yeah, get it. Yeah, it's got, First Maccabees, got, fifth chapter. Yeah, get that for me, man. That's a good one, man. First Maccabees. First Maccabees. Started 
Start at verse 11, man. Start at verse 10. Are you sure it's not hard? Matter of fact, no. Start at verse 41. First back would be chapter 1, verse 41. First Maccabees 1 verse 41. At that time, therefore, they decreed, saying, Whosoever shall come to make battle with us on the Sabbath day, we will fight against them. Wait, where you at, man? First Maccabees. Chapter 1 verse 41. Uh, first Maccabees. Oh, Skip the pages. Okay, Shlach. Uh, first Maccabees 1 verse 41. Moreover, King Antiochus wrote to his whole kingdom that all should be one people. Wait, read that shit again? Moreover, King Antiochus wrote to his whole kingdom that all should be one people. Now hold that. Give me Genesis chapter, what is it, chapter 6. Is it chapter 6? Genesis chapter. Let me show you, this, this shit is, goes back all throughout time, he talking about some damn, the devil don't want people to get together. No, that's what the damn devil wants. <laughs> Chapter 6, start at verse, wait, where it goes and talks about the damn tower, where is that shit at? Um, Tower of Babylon. Start at verse 6. Genesis 6 and 6? Yeah. Alright, Genesis. Wait, hold Genesis 11 and 1, and the whole earth oh, was of one that. language and of one speech. And it came to pass as they, as they journeyed from the east that they found a plain in the land of Shinar and they dwelt there. And they said one to another, Go to, let us make brick and burn them thoroughly. And they had brick for stone and slime had they for mortar. And they said, Go to, let us build us a city and a tower whose top may reach into heaven, and let us make us a name, lest we be scattered abroad upon the face of the whole earth. And the Lord came down to see the city and the tower. If you're a people, you need a name. So if everybody came together, they would have to have a name. Hmm. That's why I said, let us make us a name. We're also going uh -huh. to them making themselves famous, but keep going. Uh -huh. um. And they said one to another, Go to, let us make brick and burn them thoroughly. And they had brick for stone and slime, had they for mortar. And they said, Go to, let us build us a city and a tower whose top may reach into heaven. And let us make us a name, lest we be scattered abroad upon the face of the whole earth. And the Lord came down to see the city and the tower which the children of men build it. And the Lord said, Behold, the people is one. The people is what? It's one. It's what? It's one. They became one people. And what he did, go ahead. And they have all one language. They have one language, go ahead. And this they began to do, and now nothing will be restrained from them. Go ahead. Which they have imagined to do. Go ahead. Go to. Mm -hmm. Let us go down and there confound their language, mm -hmm. and they may not understand one another's speech. Mm -hmm. So the Lord scattered them abroad from thence. So he, so he separated them. As we read earlier, we're going to get that scripture again. Read, go keep going. So the Lord scattered them abroad from thence upon the face of all the earth, and they left off to build the city. Therefore, go ahead. Go ahead. therefore, it's name of it called Babel, because of the Lord did there 
confined the language of all the earth, and from thence did the Lord scatter them abroad upon the face of all the earth. He scattered them. Now, he scattered them abroad on the earth. Now, go back to the book of Sirach. Remember what I had you read? Sirach, uh, chapter 17, verse 17. Because it said that the Most High divided the people on the earth. That's when he divided them at the Tower of Babel. Go ahead. Huh? I'm talking about the Tower of Babel right now. Huh? Not a religion. What nationality of people just like you? We Israel, y'all Israelites too, whether y'all accept it or not. Israel. I believe in Jesus, but you know, I have no type, I have no, 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 religion. I believe in Jesus. I believe in God. The Lord never gave religion. We don't have religion either. Did the Lord give Moses a religion? Or did he give him laws and commandments? I wasn't born. Yeah, but it's in the Bible. Man, man what the Bible? Okay, well, I guess. Is it my, am I not correct? Who was the Bible, man? Man wrote the Bible, but it was inspired by the Most High God. Huh? Says the Bible. Says who? Says the people that wrote it. Like the people that wrote could be just Job. Who created all this? God. So then why are we questioning them the book then? How do you know God did? Who hired you? Where'd you get that? Where'd you get that from? Who hired above me? Where'd you get God from? Who hired above me? I'm saying, where'd you, where'd you get God from? You said God I believe, right? I believe. Believe what? God. Why would you say God? Why gotta Love be God? All. Ain't you get that from the Bible? I got that from me. Okay. I got that from being born. You got the title God from the Bible, man. Nah. It's okay. You can admit it, man. I don't believe the Bible, though. I'm keeping 100 with y'all. Okay, you don't I have believe, to believe, believe in a... I believe, believe in my belief. I believe in my belief. Okay. I believe in myself. Okay. I got man what the Bible, so I don't believe in that. You but said... I believe half and half, but who, who, who was born me but Jesus? Okay, you know, now listen. God. I just don't... I want you to understand this. Uh -huh. You said, I asked you, where did you I get to? I'm talking about Jesus, blacks. I asked you, like Jesus? Wait, hold on, hold on, let me ask him this. Where did Jesus? Where I get Jesus from? Yeah. I heard he came back from the Bible. I heard, <laughs> you got God from the yeah. Bible too, man. I heard, I heard he came back from the dead on Easter. That's not true, but, okay. God, the word God came out the Bible. You heard it first from the Bible, heard, man. Okay, okay, but listen. Well, I look at it as this. No, no disrespect. You know, no disrespect, no, I believe in God, I believe, I believe Abraham, I, I believe God in Jesus. No disrespect, but... We do too. Okay, so, before me, before these guys, before y'all, I guess it was dinosaurs, I guess it was Jesus. I'm here for a reason. I don't... God... Believe in the Civil War? war. Oh. Believe the Civil War happened? The Civil War? Yeah. And before my time, so I don't believe in that shit. So you don't believe in nothing that happened before the, you don't the day believe you were born? Nah, 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 it's not that, it's not that. I don't, listen, man with the Bible. Civil War happened for sure. For How'd sure. you know that? Cause man, were you there? there? Were you there? It's history, it's, it's oh, history. Wait, wait. Were you there? It's history, I wasn't, but it's history. The Bible this, is history, this history too. History? I like facts. How do you know that the Civil War happened? I got family. So you got what? family what? Family more than 100 years old. Okay, and what they tell you? They tell me a lot of sh a, a lot of things. So, how do you know that's true? What they saying? My family was lot of me. Oh, okay. my family. All right. It's my blood. What about what? Alexander the Great? You believe in him? Right. What was sticking in the blood? You know? Well, that's that's not true. But. <laughs> what? What? You don't believe water is sticking in the well, blood? Physically, yeah, but what you're talking about, you're talking about your family is more. So my people, a lot of me, well, I grew, I grew. Come on, like so your family, what everybody, about you? your family everybody will lies, but at the same time, like you know people, you know people who, who would, who would not. You ever went to church? Come on, I'm African American. My mama told me to go to church. I mean, you know what I'm Don't saying? Don't you know that the church is lying to you? And your mom took you to that, so basically she was lying to you. I ain't paid no money. Huh? I, I ain't you don't no gotta money. pay money. I ain't give. You pay attention. I didn't attention. give a dollar to, to, to but the you pastor. paid attention. Who driving the Escalade? I ain't driving. You know yeah, what but name. you paid attention, man. I paid. Of course, I pay attention always. So then you were lied to. Bye. Your Listen, mom took you. Believe for. Uh, None of what you hear, after what you see. That's what I was taught. 
Okay. Then, I, then I, what you hear after what you see. But, you, yeah, well, but you said your grandparents told you about the Civil War. He told me. He told me I got believe him. So you had to hear him, right? Of course. But you just said. I know your grand, your parents didn't teach you about the Civil War. That's what you hear. Talking about what you about, I know a little bit about everything in this in, in this world, man. Yeah. That'd be cool though. I'm gonna go ask my birthday, my nigga. It's my birthday. I want to party. I want to have a nice time. It's my birthday. Right. Could you be mad? I'm not trying to. It's my birthday, man. I'm trying to relax. Yo, stay God. I don't know how I know what you believe in. Yo, God all the way, my nigga. We're right. I don't know what you yeah, believe in. Sure I don't know what you believe in. Salute, camera. Yeah, yeah, sure, all man. Whether y'all take it or not, I you'll, so. you'll find out later, man. I yeah. guess. I hope so. Yeah. You'll find Salute. out. Salute. Yeah, yeah. Go back, man. See Jake with the philosophies of the world. <laughs> But oh, that was beautiful because what yeah. we just read about Babel. Babel, yeah, confusion. Confusion, man. He was confusing himself. That's why he had to leave. Listen, man. People always want to say that the Bible's written by men, but everything in this earth is written by men. He got caught up, but he knew he did. Yeah, so you don't believe in the Civil War? That's I believe in God and Jesus. Yeah. But I don't believe in the Bible. Where you got the concept God from, man? Right. You know, you didn't get it from 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 uh, Islam. What do you mean? Like right. Islam? You got it from the Bible, yeah, man. Get it. That's an English word in the Bible. Yeah, but keep going, man. This going back to what we were saying with Revelations. These people caught up in the image of the beast, man. These philosophies and things like that. That's what Jake caught up in, man. But this whole. One where everybody supposed to love each other, and we supposed to be one people, we all the same, we all bleed red and all this shit like that. Racism and all this shit. Go back, go back where you was. No, not Revelations. It's Ecclesiasticus. Yeah. 17 verse 17. No, go back Genesis. Old Ecclesiastes. Genesis 11. Yeah, Genesis 11. Genesis 11 and... Uh, Vanity, nigga. Yeah. 11 and 6. And the Lord said, Behold, the people is one, and they, and they have all one language. And this they began to do, and now nothing will be restrained from them, yep. which they have imagined to do. Yep. Go to, let us go down, and there confound their language, that they may not understand one another's speech. Right. So the Lord scattered them. Why would the Most High do a terrible thing like that? Why would he divide people? Why are we supposed to all come together? Yeah. How could he do such a terrible thing like that? Divide up the nations, man. That's crazy. Man. Go ahead. Lord, I ain't a Christian. <laughs> Go so, ahead. So the Lord scattered them Sick abroad man. from thence upon the face of all the earth, and they left off to build the city. He scattered them on the face of the earth. <laughs> <laughs> he said there were one people, yeah. and he scattered them, man. He scared, scattered them because it, it's fun. It's fun to bring them all back together, man. Right? For you to find your way all back together, so he just scatter you. Right? So if he scattered them from the beginning, that don't make sense. Why would he bring them together in the most wickedest kingdom ever, the wick, the most wickedest time of the, of the that's ever been in the world? Why would he bring them together now? So they could just indulge in wickedness all together. You don't fucking mix. Uh, you don't mix onions and oranges, man. You don't mix onions, you, you mix the onions with the oranges and leave them together, the oranges going to start tasting like um, onions, man. Right. So why would he mix them together now? Go ahead. Therefore is the name of it called Babel. Yeah, why would he mix <laughs> the righteous with the wicked? It said the righteous is better, than, it said in the Proverbs, the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, right. but the wicked seduces him, man. So why would the Most High want to mix the nation of Israel, his righteous seed, that he worked so hard, like we read in the book of 2nd um, Edges, why would he mix them with the wicked? It make no damn sense. he would be contradicting himself. He'd be contradicting himself. Then he'll be a god of confusion, which he's not. Right. Where you at? No, go to sick, go to um, Sirach. Because we already showed that the Most High scattered them, man. The Most High mixed them. Uh, they became one people in the book of Genesis. And then the Most High confused their languages and scattered them. Mixed, uh, divided them. So let's go read it in um, Sirach. 17 to 17. 
the lighting is different colors. It's right, 17 and 17. Okay. For the, the, the division of the nations of the whole earth, he said a ruler over every people. See, he divided them. You go over here, you go over here, you go over here, gave them their lands, and then he set up rulers over each people. But he didn't set up a ruler over Israel at first because Israel was his people. Go ahead. But Israel is the Lord's portion, who being his firstborn, he nourished with discipline and giving him the light of his love, if not forsaken. That's it. So now, let's go to 1 Maccabees chapter 1, verse 41 to show you that these heathens have always sought to become one people because becoming one people is rebellion against the order of the Most High God. That's why in Genesis chapter 11, as we read, the Most High confounded their languages and scattered them, man, because they were rebelling against them. And it's the same thing today. We just read it, 1 John chapter 3, verse 8 that this kingdom is of wickedness, so why would he bring everybody together to rebel against him again? Go ahead. Basically, what's going on right now, what the brother just saying is, this is the same thing all over again. They're just trying to build up to the Tower of Babel all over again. Only thing is, you don't see no actual tower. Give me Malachi 1 and 4. But it's the philosophy. It's not They're trying to do it all over again. That's the big delusion right there. They trying to do it all over again, man. Huh? That shit crazy. Don't you know I say that in the scriptures? I, we, we, matter of fact, let's get it. Let's, let's it. get it. I know a couple places. They ain't Habakkuk. Give me the book of Habakkuk, man. Now I want you to get Malachi 1. Start at verse 1. Read verse 1. It's Malachi 101. The burden of the word of the Lord to Israel by Malachi. I have loved you, said the Lord, yet ye say, wherein hast thou loved us? Was not Esau Jacob's brother, said the Lord? Yet I loved Jacob, and I hated Esau and lay his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. Whereas Edom said, we are impoverished, but we will return and build the desolate places. Thus said the Wait, Lord of hosts. Read that again, read that again, that part. And, uh, was not Esau Jacob's brother, said the Lord? Yet I loved Jacob, and I hated Esau, and laid his mountains and his heritage waste for the dragons of the wilderness. Whereas Edom said, we are impoverished, but we will return to build the desolate places. Wait, we, were, we are impoverished, and we will return and build the desolate places, man. That's, that's, that's what Esau, that's what they're doing. Coming back, trying to build up America, build up the culture of Rome, and then bring all these people, heap up all these people to themselves, and bring everybody under this one world banner of this one human race, man. Of everybody turning to one people and one religion. All right, that's it on that. Go ahead, have a cool. Yeah, Habakkuk 2 and 5, it says, Yea, also, because he transgresses by wine. Right. Which is philosophy. Wait, wait, wait. Which is going back to that image, partly of that image. That's not exactly what the image is. It's just part of it. There's philosophies that they keep coming up to us with. With this, Everybody needs to come together and love and love. And lovey-dovey this and lovey that. And Everybody needs to come together. We're all one people. We're all the children of God. The Bible doesn't say that. That's what you learn in this in this wicked ass empire. Go ahead. Yea, also because he transgressive by wine, he is a proud man. Neither keep it at home. Keep going. Who enlarges his desire as hell and is as death and cannot be satisfied. Right. But gather unto him all nations and heap unto him all people. Doing what? 
Going to what? Going back to how they did in Genesis chapter 11 at the Tower of Babel, trying to bring every nation together right. under this one banner. Right. But the Most High don't want it like that, man. Otherwise, he wouldn't, it wouldn't be no Genesis 11 talking about the Tower of Babel and how he scattered these people scattered. that came together, man. That's right. The Most High is a separatist. He divided the nations. That's right. Go ahead. That was Nimrod. No, Nimrod didn't divide. Nimrod brought together. Nimrod brought together? Yeah. Yes. He was trying to build the Tower of Babel? Twice. Trying to build it. Yeah. They call Nimrod the mighty hunter. You know what that means? It means a mighty hunter. No, it means that he was a conqueror. He conquered people and brought them together just like cool. America cool. Right. does. True. Cool. What so, he got destroyed eventually. Uh -huh. Him? Yeah, but God scattered the languages. Yeah. Right. We just the scattered the people. The whole, that's Yahweh. Nah. He scattered, the, scattered the languages. Okay, go ahead, read that. It's first back of these, 1 verse 41. And read it, Jim. Moreover, King Antiochus wrote to his whole kingdom that all should be one people. Amen. That what? That all should be one, one people. people. Right, that all should be one people. Now, this trying is against, again. Oh. right, trying to do it again. Trying to do it again. Just like America's trying to do. What does what the Statue of Liberty say? Right. Bring me your poor and your sick. Yeah, but... Why do they, but they're not the doing it though. It's the melting pot. Who? America? Who's doing it? America's doing it. Heaping up all the nations together. They are. They're trying. Yeah, right. going back. That's why America's Babylon. They are Babylon. The great Babylon is going to fall though. I'm, I'm Revelation, glad it says they're going to fall. Yeah, I'm glad you know that. <laughs> they're going to fall and then, and then the whole world's, world's going to mourn over their fall. No, no they're not. What do you mean it says it in Revelation? It says they're going to yeah, mourn. Yeah, some of them mourn. But we're going to rejoice. Who? The righteous. The righteous are going to rejoice. Right. When the Babylon falls. Yeah. Because it wasn't right in the first place. Right. right. So go ahead, read that. Oh my God. Okay. Help. Right. Like, yo, I don't even. Go I, ahead. I already uh, drove by you one time. <laughs> go ahead. Moreover, King Antiochus wrote to his whole kingdom that all should be one people and everyone should leave his laws so all the heathen agreed according to the commandment of the king yea many also of the Israelites consented to his religion and sacrificed unto idols consented to his what? Uh, his religion yeah many also of the Israelites consented to his religion and sacrificed unto idols and prophesied and profaned the Sabbath for the king has sent letters by messengers unto Jerusalem and the cities of Judah, they should follow the strange laws of the land. Right, and that's exactly why they're teaching all these people that we're all brothers and sisters and everybody's the children of God. We should all love each other. We should all love each other because they don't want the children of Israel to wake up and come, okay, we're Israelites, we're a separate nation. Oh, the Most High God gave us these laws. Right. They don't want you to do that. Nope. So, what do they do? They teach you in school that we're all brothers and sisters. Right. We're all human beings and Martin Luther King and we should come together and this, that, and the other. Because that's, that goes back to the Tower of Babel. So like the brother said, everything, them people that was in the Tower of Babel that was building that, that, that tower. That was the truth? That was the people yo, that's here today. Yo, I've been, been, okay? been, been teaching though, the teaching right. that I've been getting is that that wasn't the truth. It's not the truth, man. You got the Tower of Babel wasn't the truth. You know you got a wicked symbol in your hand right now, man. You know what that symbolizes? Oh, this? No. No, even you hold it down like that. This? Yeah. You know what that symbolizes? Ishtar, the goddess of the um, the female goddess of Babylon. Samurai. Semiramis or Ishtar, yes. Yeah, I know. That's what that symbolizes. You shouldn't hold your hand like that. It brings a wicked vibration on you. <laughs> I'm straight out there. Listen, I've been trying to, I've been following, do you think of Christ? Yeah. Messiah? Oh, God. Yeah, but he wasn't a white man. You know that? Obviously, I know that. Okay, cool. Well, yeah, sure. He wasn't that he was man. A, he was a Jew. <laughs> yeah, but the How Jew. How was he white if he was a Jew? But the so-called Jews today, they're white. No, they're not. They don't classify themselves as white, but they are. 
They're the same color as you. I like them from the I don't I don't look at any color though. I look at the true one one true God. Yeah, well one true God is Jacob Isaac Jacob Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, bro. Yeah, but what, what one true God. What did Abraham Isaac Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, what did they look like? Did they look like the people that's in Israel at that what the fuck? That's some animal whatever you want to do, burp whatever you want to do. Did Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob? I don't know what they look like, but I'll tell you right now, I know who they were. I knew who they were to God. Friends of God. Children of God. You know that. Some people in Israel today aren't the Israelites. It's just Paul said not all Israel is of Israel. That's what Paul says. Paul was a true Israelite. And it was true. To the point. And he said, not all Israel is of Israel. That's true, right. man. And I believe that fully 100%. I who's live Israel? by that. Who's Israel, though? Israel is the children of God. Yeah, who's that? All those who believe in, in the oh, Son man. of God. All those who See? believe in the, That's in what the, we in the one about, true that God. Wine, philosophy. That wine, all of those who believe in the one true God. That's not now, the children of Israel. Let me ask you something, man. Uh, you have any siblings, like brothers and sisters? Six, five. All right. Am I one of your brothers and sisters? Absolutely. No, seriously. Did I come out of your mother? No, in Christ. No, I'm asking you, did I come out of your mother? No. Right. So I'm not your brother, right? Not by blood. But you're saying that in the spirit, I am your brother, right? 100%. Now, does that say that in the Bible? Yeah, it does. Okay. Yeah. Let me get, uh, uh, get something. I want to ask him a question. Man. All right, go ahead. Ask me a question, bro. I want to ask you a question. All right. Ask me a question. So check it out. What's your last, if you don't mind me asking, what's your last name? Sullivan. Sullivan, right? Irish. Now, don't you know last name or surname, that was tribes. That, you, that would be a tribe. Yeah. The last name, you would be of the tribe of Sullivan. Yeah, yeah. All right, now me, being from a whole other continent, could I, could I be the same, could I be, could I be of the Sullivan tribe? No. Why? I love the Sullivan tribe. Because I wasn't born in the Southern no. tribe, right? I would be of another tribe, right? Yeah. Well, Israel is a tribal people. Yeah. So, in order to be of uh, Israelite, you have to be of born in that tribe. I remember that they were exiled and they were scattered throughout all the nations. That tribal people. All the nations they were scattered, though. Right. They were scattered. Okay. They were exiled throughout all the nations yes. of the, and almost the entire yes. world. Yes, yes. Right. So what's but the it, point? But it's not about the blood. It's it's about it is about. It's about his blood. It's about the blood. It's about his blood. Give me Romans chapter nine, verse one. That's what I was trying it's to about, get. It's about the blood of Christ, though. It's not about the blood of. It's not about the blood of any any man. It's about the blood of Christ alone, not the but blood in of order, man. In order to get to that blood of Christ, you have to be of the blood of Israel. No, you don't. Why, Who did Christ not? come to die for? He came to die for all. It no. says John 3.16. For said, God so the world that he gave I, his I only brother on right, seven. Whosoever believe in him God. should not he perish might, but have everlasting life, bro. He might be right, man. Right? Right? For Anybody. The, Paul preached to the Gentiles, bro. I'm a Gentile. I'm a Gentile that was scattered abroad. That was brought into the kingdom of heaven, bro. See. By the faith in Jesus Christ alone, dude. I think, I think you're right. I'm going to read it. Yo, it says in, in Ephesians 4, it says, that For by grace you have been saved through faith and that not of yourself is Let's the gift it. of God, not Matthews, of works, lest any man should boast. Matthews 1 and 20, you might be right, but while he thought on these things, behold, the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a dream, saying, Joseph, thou son of David, fear not to take unto thee Mary thy wife, for that which is conceived in her is of the Holy, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost, and she shall bring forth a son. And thou shalt call his name Jesus, Jesus, for he shall save his people from their sins. He loves all people. His people. He didn't all, say all people. He loves all people. He said his Yo, people. he didn't say all people would choose him, but he said he loves all he people. He said he shall save his okay. people. Yeah, but you read all the scripture, hey. he says he loves he all loves people. Him. It says he wishes that none should okay. perish. Okay. He wishes that okay. none should perish. Okay. None should perish. Okay. Yo, he prolongs the days of man so that none okay. would okay. perish. Okay. The only reason why he's letting this okay. world go okay. on as long okay. as it's going. Wanna, sorry, go ahead, Romans 9. Alright. Oh, you want to give me a phone? Yeah. Alright. All right. Romans 9 and 1. This should just end it all, man. Listen good, man. Romans 9 and 1. I say the truth in Christ. I lie not. My conscience also bear me witness in the Holy Ghost. 
that I have great heaviness and continual sorrow in my heart. For I could wish that myself were cursed from Christ, but my brethren, my kinsmen, according to the flesh. What does that mean? It means that all men was all men were the same. My kinsmen according to the flesh. It's all the same. Okay, let's read. Who are Israelites? Who were Israelites? Paul said, "Not all Israel is of Israel." Right. So, who are the Israelites? The ones who who, who believe in faith by faith. It says that Paul was accounted by faith. Go to, uh, so there's no Israelites around here walking that's that's really actual Israelites. Who are Israelites? Israel. Yo, I believe, got it right here. Yo, bro. God says that if you curse Israel, you're cursed. So you don't curse Israel. I got Because uh, the children of God, the children of God, He says He's going to reconcile this, all His children to Him in the end. Yeah, but you don't know who the he children just said, of Israel. He just proved his point, man. He, yeah, exactly. He just proved that point. This is Matthew 10 verse 5. <laughs> These twelve Jesus sent forth and commanded them, saying, Go not into the way of the Gentiles, and into any of the city of the Samaritans, into ye not, but go rather to the lost sheep of the house of Israel. So, you said earlier, you were a Gentile or whatever. He, he, he said, go go not to the Gentile. He said, go to the lost sheep of yeah. the house of Israel. So he only cares about Israel. No, it shows it's not you. true, it's bro. It's, 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 it's not right true. Here. Christ came for the Gentile, too. Yo, he talked to the Gentile. Yo, who did he talk to at the Who did he talk to at the well? Who did he not? No pictures. Yeah, okay. Who did he talk to at the well? He talked to the woman at the well. Who was she? She was a Samaritan. She was a Gentile. What did he tell her? He used up on his own. Yo, he saved her, bro. He saved her, bro, out of out of all the all, all the sin, bro. All the sin and death. He told her to go get her husband. He said, John to the four. He did. Christ came for the Gentiles, but you're not understanding this who the Gentiles are. Who did Paul preach to? He, he preached to the Gentiles. All right, then why? Well, who are they? The Gentiles are all those who are not of Israel. Okay, so they're not of Israel. Israelite, what? Let me ask you a question. The Gentiles, right? Did the Gentiles come with the flood? Did the Gentiles come through the part of this, the Red Sea with Moses? No. Okay, so when Paul went to the Corinthians, who were the Corinthians? Well, were, were, were of another race, of another religion. Okay, they, well, they, that's why he preached a strict religion to them, to stay, to stay focused, to stay organized. Wait, they could answer the question. So, the Corinthians were of another race, right? Yes. That's what you say, right? Now, since the Corinthians were of another race, they weren't Israelites, right? So it was the blood, bro. Wait, hold on, hold on, his blood. The Corinthians were another race, right? So if they were another race, that means their 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 um forefathers didn't go through the um the part of the Red Sea out of Egypt with Moses, right? Okay, now let's get let's get let's get Second Corinthians. My, my Lord and King is the one of Israel. I'm an Israelite. That's why I can say. Wait, get First Corinthians chapter ten, verse one. First Corinthians 10 and 1. Israelite of the flesh. So let me get this right again. The Corinthians were not Israelites, right? No, it's spiritual. It's all about faith. It's by faith, not by works. He gave the law to the Israelites. Let me get this right. So the Corinthians were not Israelites. No. So that means that their forefathers didn't go through the, the um, sea with Moses, right? Okay, now just read that. First Corinthians 10 verse 1. Moreover, brethren, I would not that ye should be ignorant. How that all our fathers were under the cloud and all passed through the sea. Wait, hold on. Exile. Why did he say all of our fathers when he's talking to the Corinthians? Yeah, but what did he say about Abraham? It don't matter. He's it talking to matter. the Corinthians. So if he's talking, that's like me talking to you saying, don't you remember when we were in slavery? I do. Yeah, but if I say that, well, if I say to you, don't you remember that all of our fathers were in slavery and I'm talking to you. Yes. And you and this, we, we all together. I was in slavery. I, yeah, yeah, why would I? Slavery. Yeah, but for me, I was in slavery. But that would mean that you're a so-called Negro, right? Fuck it. So then the Corinthians, so then the Corinthians, he's proving my point. So then the Corinthians are really Israelites. Hey, they are. Thank you. 
<laughs> According to the place. We up? He gonna get that part though, man. He, to the place. he think it's because of the spirit. So the Corinthians are Israelites according to the flesh. We're all blood from Abe, Adam and Eve? No, not no, we all. We got, we what do you mean that. we're all one blood? And, and originally... The Corinthians forefathers go back to the people that came through the Red Sea with Moses. Yeah, but they originally came through Adam and Eve, one line. But that ain't talking one about blood anyway. That it doesn't matter. It was all one blood. Yo, that's why we speak one, one love, Seven. one blood. It's all about one. It you, doesn't matter you, where it came you're from. You're trying to go around. No, Christ, trying to go around Christ, 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 no, Christ, Christ demolished religion. I want to I wanna ask you something. If we're all just supposed to be one person, why are there just different races around, period? Right? Fuck, what, shit, why shit, are we no, talking listen, about different races? Think about it. All the different races. Why just be one race? It should. Oh, why isn't it though? You saw the it was a scatter. No, check it. But why is it scattered? There, there was Adam and Eve, bro. It is. There were bro, two. Bro, that's there that was two. That's a All man. right, Cain went out. I don't know why. All right. You, you know what? You know what? You, Jesus, you know what we're Jesus? Tell you, you know what Jesus said though? Jesus said, "When you know me, you're not gonna have any more questions." Most I keep bringing that up. He said, "If you know me, you're not gonna have any more questions." That one race thing, man. You see that? That which was lost, right? That which was lost, right? Which was all men who were lost. All, no, all who that were lost. Was Israel was lost, man. All and Paul said, "Not all Israel is of Israel." Do you know what that means? It means that not all Israel is of Israel. Yeah. What do you get out of that? I get out of that that that. Were, that Israel was a faith that the children of God, because it says Abraham was a, it says Israel. Abraham, Abraham was accounted righteous because now, of his man. faith, not because of his works, not because of anything he did, not because of his blood, but Maybe because of his works faith. Did, man. Yeah. What are the works that you do? The law, the law, the commandment. One hate without works is dead, man. No. You follow the commandments. Not all the time. Hey, get my, get uh, follow, follow the commandments. Get John Every four and twenty two. Man. Because God told me to. Because, because, because the Holy Spirit says, follow my hey, commands. Wait, follow follow me. me. John four and twenty two. Because he's talking about that woman. Jesus said, follow me. He's talking about that woman at the well, right? So you asking me about the woman at the well, right? No, there's no. Right. But what did Even Jesus, the Good Samaritan. What about the Good Samaritan? What is, the, the Israelites hated the Samaritans. All right, the Samaritan. What did he say about him? What did he say about him? What did Jesus say to that woman? He said, "I know all. I know about you." He said, "You have five husbands." What else did he say? You have many husbands. He said, "What was the most important thing?" Yeah, get to the meat. Get to the meat, man. What was the important thing about this? We'll read it. We'll read it. Yeah, read, it read it, homie. So I don't miss it. The John 4, 422. Ye worship, ye know not what. What what she worship? Ye worship, ye know not what. Go ahead. We know what we worship for salvation. Wait, 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 wait. wait, wait, wait. That was a division. <laughs> <laughs> that was a division. <laughs> Go read that again. Ye worship, ye know not what. <laughs> now he gonna divide himself from her. He he said, I, he said, we. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. before you even read that, what is he going to say, salvation is for who? Everybody? Yeah, hey, look, it's funny. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's funny is that she said that why have you asked me of water because the Jews have no yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, but <laughs> Now, how, do that. how many now, people had faith after her? It doesn't know. We've been to deal with the scripture. It was by faith. Now, now, yeah, but for Jesus, by grace you have been saved. Wait, hold on. Now, Jesus does, grace, done divided the Jews. Faith. And Jesus done divided the Jews it ain't about yourself. from the Samaritans. It ain't about yourself. For by grace you have been saved. Now you're going to something else. Faith, and that, that not you. of yourself. Go ahead, read that. The gift of God. No, we got we got to read this. Read it. Go ahead. Ye worship, yeah. ye know not what. Gift the Lord. We know what we worship. For salvation is of the Jews. Wait, wait, oh, I what? A, I consider myself a Jew, bro. You can say whatever you want. I am a Jew. By flesh. Romans 9 told she you according to the flesh. Jew, man. Say it. <laughs> she did. You see doing the same what you doing, man. He said you know not what you worship. <laughs> we tell him you don't know what you worship, man. She said that she was... is of the Jews, Right. Man. It's of the Jews. Now what you should be asking is, damn, who the Jews, man? I know who the Jews are. Who are the Jews, man? The Jews are the ones who have faith in Christ. Man. Oh, yeah. The ones who are blood of the Israelite tribes. 
The 12 tribes of Israel. The blood. 144,000 okay, were to come to witness. The ask. ones who have been set apart from the defilement of women. Name one tribe. Levi. Who are they? Judah. I mean, who are they? Levi tribe? Where are they today? Where are they at? Yeah, where are they at? They're all, they're around the world. Oh, man. <laughs> what do you mean? Yo, the, the tribes of Israel were scattered and exiled throughout Israel, throughout the whole world, and breeding with the whole world, bro. Who was posted? Who was posted? Christ, dude, Wait, God, God divided the Israelites throughout the whole world we and scattered them and Who exiled them throughout to bring? the world, bro. Who was so therefore, their blood is in every single tribe of the whole world. No, it's not. It ain't about that blood, one? man. Listen, you get that? Who was supposed to bring forth the truth in the last days? Right. The 144, the Jews, the Jews. Right. Therefore, you must know who the Jews is if you if you know the truth. <laughs> I know who the Jews are. Who are they? The Israelites. <laughs> what what, 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 what are you looking at the Jews, man? <laughs> We're the Jews. Just admit, just admit, you don't know who the, who the Jews are. <laughs> you don't know who the 12 tribes of Israel. Just admit it. Twelve tribes of Israel are scattered throughout yeah. the world. Yeah, but who are they? You said it's you already just admitted that you're supposed to go to them for the truth, right? Yeah. Okay, so who are they? Who do you go to for the truth? Who you go to for the truth? That's what I'm talking. That's why we out here, man. We trying to tell you who. Telling you the truth. Trying to tell but you're you, trying to tell me that, that I'm not of the faith. You're proving. You're proving what we've been teaching but about But are you trying to night. tell me that I'm not of the faith no, of Christ? No, we're not. We're trying to tell you that these people on this song. I know who the Israel. twelve. Dude. Yo. What are they preaching Christ alone? What do you mean? It was Christ the Messiah. Yeah, he's the Messiah. Yeah, he's the Messiah. Of the Israelites. All right. He's the Messiah. All the Israelites. All. Israelites. No, all. Wait, when they put him on the cross, what did they say? Did they say the king of the world? He said all. Let's say the Jews are not of the world, bro. Yo, Wait, this world is not of flesh, bro. When it ain't of flesh and blood, it's of spirit and Christ. So this is the flesh of the world. Yo, no. Yeah, but it, but exactly. And when this flesh dies, it goes into the ground, cursed where it belongs. The Jews are cursed belong where it where it belongs. Even the Jews alone are cursed to the ground. Just as Adam and Eve said they were cursed. He said you were cursed to death alone your curse you keep the law by itself then you're good unless you have faith you're dead so it doesn't matter how you talking backwards man it doesn't matter bro what you got man? let me read something real quick i want you to just break it down for us because you, you got a lot you got a lot of knowledge man listen so i've been grown up in this check this I out i was beat into this Acts you had on the show be into christ and 21 it says it shall come to pass that whosoever shall call in the name of the lord shall be saved. Amen. Ye men of Israel. <laughs> I am of Israel, bro. I'll tell you right now. You just said you didn't know who they were. You just said they were scattered. <laughs> See, man, you, you, Israel you, you was get brought together up, in 1940. They were brought back out of exile. Now, now you going to that shit. They were brought back out of exile in the 40s. Okay, they were scattered. They were brought back together. But you just said you know, Revelation talked about the 1940s. That Revelation talked about that shit. But you get a scripture in Revelation, right? Revelation chapter two verse eight. It's Revelation. See, we're, talk, we're talking. It's a good one. It's we're, a good one. We're right? talking we're separate. Of the, we're talking. It's Revelation two verse eight. We're gonna talk in the flesh. Talk in the flesh. Revelation. Yeah, not my bad. Nah. I know the spirit. Nah, the spirit nah. of God is one. And it's one with it's all Revelation. the children of God. I, I agree with that. All right. And, it's, and it, it says, and it Wait, says, hold on, hold on. Let's read the spirit of God confirms that you are a child of God. He says he gives you a deposit when you put your faith in Christ alone. He gives you a deposit. It says that in the word. Don't say deposit in the Bible. Now it does. No, it don't. Like, like, a, like a bank deposit? Yeah. He deposits the Holy Spirit. He gives you a deposit of the Holy Spirit. And the, and, the, and the Holy Spirit confirms that you are a son of God. It's Revelation 2 and 9. I know thy works in tribulation and poverty, but thou art rich. Hey, wait, hold on. The people of Israel are not they in poverty. Are they in poverty no, and tribulation? No, not at all. From last, last time I heard, they were putting people in tribulation. Right. They're not in poverty at all. They are in tribulation. They got money. They have money. They got okay, money. so obviously this is not talking about them right there. <laughs> I don't know, it might be going. Yeah, okay, well, yeah, let's keep going. Jesus. And I know the blasphemy of them which say, 
of them which say they are Jews and are not. Wait, who said they were Jews? <laughs> Who's saying that they're Jews right now? Yeah, but you gotta you get you get stung stung by blood. What? Man, you it's talking in, blood, bro. You talking in circles, It ain't just man. about the blood, bro. You ready to what happened? shed all his blood, bro. He what, suffered on the cross, bro. What you just say happened in 1940? Yo, right. He suffered. Dude, but what you my, just say happened in My Lord and Savior, all right? My Lord and Savior are the sins of the world, bro. He says it's what, the sins of the world that he covered. What happened in 1940? He says he covered, he covered all the sins of the world. In his suffering, he covered all the sins of the world, bro. But what happened in 1940? You, we talking about that they right were, now. They, and they were, they, were, they were brought out of, uh, out of Israel and they were persecuted. The Jews, right? Yeah, the okay. Jews. And they called themselves uh, what? Yo, check this. Italian, they were living in Italy, all right, so there was Italian and Jews mixed. They were taking all the Italians and the Jews mixed and killing them too, remember? There were Negroes over there too. They were killing they, us Yeah, they had breeded with Italians. There were Negroes over there in Germany, they was killing us too. They were killing everybody, bro. Not everybody. Dude, the, Jew, the, Jew, the, the Germans believed that they were superior race and they were killing everybody. Yep. All right? But the point is, the point that we were talking about is that those are not the real Jews. Because you are by your own admittance that they're not a problem, right? You're looking at, you're looking at the words it starts, the it starts, you're looking at the flesh. Wait, hold on. It starts in the flesh. Give me Hebrew chapter. Give me. It starts in the flesh. Romans, no? No, Hebrews. Hebrews. Hebrews not. You can't totally, you cannot totally disregard flesh according to the Bible. I know we can't totally flesh, but flesh, flesh dies. Flesh is a part of the Bible. Flesh dies. It starts with the flesh, the flesh of who you are. The flesh is, you have to be of the, the flesh. You have to be of the flesh to inherit the gifts of the Spirit. You have to be of the flesh of Israel to inherit the gifts I've been of the Spirit. For a long time, man. It and tells you that. The spirit to preach and to do well, worship. why are you not preaching? <laughs> You're trying to preach the preachers, right? Right, right, right. You're trying to teach teachers. Because I went through a divorce and adultery and all that What's shit. What that got to do? What that got to do with anything? They put me on, it's because I had the, I let the church put me on hold. How was that bring, how was that church teach, How was that teaching, teaching the world, man? Huh? Hebrews look. You can't let the church put you on hold. <laughs> but Who I is that, man? Slick dude, man. <laughs> Listen, man, this has been my whole life, bro. Slick dude, man. This has been my whole life, bro. What's that that we know Judah? Um, the one about Yahushua coming out of, um, oh, coming out of the tribe of Judah. Yeah, it's in the book yeah. of Hebrews. Oh, it's evident that he, uh, uh Lord yeah. sprang out of, uh, Hebrews, uh, yeah. five. 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 No, Hebrews. Yeah, listen, listen, the enemy, listen, the devil attacks me with this all the time. You you can say to me all the time. You 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 guys can say, you can, you can say to me, oh, by, by, by faith you're not saved. Wait, hold on, hold on, look. I'm gonna show you something. Wait, hold on, look. Go ahead. I'm not saved by the flesh. Give me first John. Now, wait a minute, wait a minute. Let me ask you the flesh. Didn't he say in the beginning that uh, he said you know that Christ was black, right? Or did you say you know he wasn't white? Which one did you say? It's a Jew. Right, so he was he was white. Whatever color he was, it doesn't matter. He was yeah. dark skin. I know that uh, for sure. Okay, he was dark skin. Yeah. What tribe did he come out of? He came out of the tribe, the tribe of Judah. Okay. Which, which is wait 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 is that the spiritual tribe of Judah? Right. No, that was the physical tribe of Judah. So he started with flesh. Yeah. He came started he came out of the tribe of Judah to save the people of Israel. He saved all. Well, read. Let, let's you save the whole world, bro. Let's deal with the flesh. You, you, you're, you're saying that the, you're saying that the, that your God didn't save all those who would believe in Him. He doesn't. He didn't save everybody. He no. saved all those who would believe in Him. He did And upon His Son. He did it. He did. He did not. not. He but did. He the saved all those said, who believe on Him. He read in Matthew. The prophecy said that He would come to save His people. His people. From who were his wait, 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 wait. From the beginning of time, wait, wait, his people wait, 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 weren't wait. just the Jews. They were all people. Wait, so you're missing it. Hold on. You're missing it. He said he would save his people from their sins. Yeah. 
Sin. 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 No. Sin is the transgression of Again? the law. You cannot sin unless you're under. You're, you're, you're wait, saying that on. the Jews haven't sinned against the law? You cannot Every wait. single Jew sinned against the law. Man, listen. Why? I don't care what you say. Why? All, sin, all Jews have sinned against the law. Why? Because they are under the covenant of the law. You cannot sin against the law unless you're under the covenant. I cannot break a Russian law because I'm not under in Russia under covenant with the Russian government. All human beings were under the under you the law don't of God. Basic laws. Yep, the law of God. You're looking is at under this book law. like it's a religion. It's not a religion, man. It's a book of laws. Okay, this is real. This is not a very it's real. Man. Okay, well you got to deal. Like well you real. have to know how to deal with law. This book is a book of law. If you if you do something wrong, you need a lawyer to yeah, go. Yeah, my and Christ is my lawyer, bro. See, what he's saying, he's he stands saying as my advocate, bro. He's saying that everybody on the whole face of the earth is under that law. Under that law, every single person's under that law. Bro. Get that. Give me book of Malachi. Every person's it's under Malachi. Did you read Malachi? Every person's under that law, bro. Sure. What is that? Every Psalms person's 19? under that law, bro. Give me the book of Malachi. You can tell me not every person's under that Last, law. Every Malachi single chapter person. Four. I've been evangelizing the streets for years, bro. For You're street. not under the law, man. <laughs> We're all under the law. Tell me bro. one law, man. Keep the Lord God your, your only one and only. That's a commandment. Amen. What's a law? Give me a law. Do not commit adultery. You, you do eat not pork? Lit, steal. Do not lie. Eat pig? Can I, huh? can I, can I read something, bro? Yeah. Can I read something? That's against the law. That's against you, the law. You know that. You know. Yeah, but see, what, 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 what Christians no, 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 no. What Christians have done in the past, over the course of Christianity, have they they've gone with Peter's Peter's teaching, which Peter had the vision. That's what I was saying. And he saying. had the vision of the seafood and, that, and all and the had, stuff that he could eat. Guess what? That, that had was nothing actually, to do with the law. Bro. It had okay. Then it goes against everything you're saying. No, it's then not. It had to no, do, it's not. Then it had to do with the Gentiles. It, it had was to do not with the talk. Gentiles. Then, Who then it had to do with he made all pure. He bro. made all clean. He made all righteous. How did they get dirty in the first place? They were dirty because they didn't have Christ. Because they uncircumcised themselves and became heathen. They didn't have. It doesn't matter about the circumcision. It doesn't even matter. If you can be uncircumcised, circumcised, the fleshly you know, circumcision I mean. doesn't matter, I'm bro. I'm not even talking about the fleshly not circumcision. Not talking about I'm talking about the spiritual circumcision. They uncircumcise themselves. You cannot, you cannot um, uncircumcise yourself. If you're circumcised, you can't go back to the knock. No, you can't. Get the shit put back on. You can't. I'm not talking about that. What I'm talking about is that they were keeping the laws at one time, and they stopped keeping the laws. So they uncircumcised themselves. What is grace? But the Most High said, "Don't call anything unclean that I have clean." Meaning that these people, these people were, were um, breaking the laws, but I have brought them back by faith. And that was the Gentiles and the Jews. That was not the Gentiles. What are you talking about, dude? Look at the whole New Testament. It talks about Jews and Gentiles. We just proved it in First Corinthians chapter ten. Who the Corinthians were? They were Israelites. Now wait a minute. I just want to go with what he said. Well, who are the he? he said, you said that everybody's under the law, right? Now let's just read it. Let's just read what the Bible yeah, says. Yeah, but everybody's under faith more so than the law. Because Psalms, Christ said I came to fulfill the law. Wait, wait, hold on. Psalms, I came to fulfill the law. Say this real quick. No, because the argument was that we brought we brought it out of Matthew chapter one that the Lord that his name is gonna be Jesus to save his people from their sins. Wait, wait, hold on. And you said that everybody is under sin or under the law. Yeah. You said everybody. Everybody. Was. So now he's going to prove to you who was actually under the law. Psalms 147 and 19. Listen good, man. He showed his word unto Jacob, his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. He have not dealt so with any nation. And as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye the Lord. None of the other nations had the law but Jacob, we got which is one. Israel, which are the Israelites. They just said it. He have not dealt so with any other tribe, or not any other tribe, any other nation. Why? Because these laws were just for Israel, man. We got another one for you. Go ahead, read that out. I mean, I mean, really, what can I say? You got another one, man. I didn't know that before either, man, so I read it. And it makes sense. Go ahead. Read, read it. Go ahead. It's Malachi, Malachi. Yep. Malachi 4 and 4. Can I read it from your Bible? Remember ye the law of Moses, my servant, oh, man. which I commanded unto him in Horeb. Read that again. 
Remember ye the law of Moses, my servant. Would, the Mo would Moses come down with the laws to everybody? Of course not. Go ahead. Hey, see, I Which I commanded unto him in Horeb for all Israel. Uh, read it. Read it. Yeah. With the statutes and judgments. Amen. Read that part again. Remember ye the law of Moses, my servant, which I commanded unto him in Horeb for all Israel. For all Israel. We all came from. We all came from two. We all came from two. So it's Amos chapter three, verse one. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel, against the whole family which I brought up from Egypt, saying. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. Oh, Therefore will I punish you three. for your iniquity. Four, Read that again. Four. You got you. Oh, the iniquities. You didn't even hear that. Every Amos chapter one. three. That's, it. That's the opposite oh, of what you read. Word, hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel. Okay. Against the whole this, family. He condemned the whole nation. Against Israel. the whole family, which I brought up from the land of he Egypt, miss, saying. Wait, 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 you miss the word that he says he took, hit the inheritance from Israel, and he gave it to the Gentiles? Did you miss that scripture? You didn't even read, right, that. read that. Miss oh, that one. Let read let that read one. It, 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 it says it. You only have I known of all the families. You only have I known of all the families. Alright, read the rest. Read the rest. Read the rest. You only have I known of all the families of the earth. The earth. Right that's what I said earlier. So what, is that, what, is, wait a minute, what does that mean? Hey, what I said earlier. That is not what it says. It says, you no, Israel, brother, if I, I know earlier. everybody. I know Israel, bro. Israel's my family, bro. Oh, Jacob, Isaac, I will punish my you. family, dog. Those are my forefathers. I will punish my you forefathers for all your iniquities. my forefathers for all, all your iniquities, man. Oh, what are iniquities? What are iniquities? Because my Lord and Savior, because I could not keep the commands. My thing is this. If, if the most high God gave everybody the laws and loves everybody, I hear what I said to him. So I wouldn't even know listen, what, and listen, no, I wouldn't even know what covetous was. I wouldn't even know what coveting was unless the law was given to me. Why did he bring the children of Israel out of Egypt? There was a whole there was, there was other, Abraham because he made the promise Luke. to Abraham. Right? There was okay. no other reason. So he was going to annihilate them. For what? what? Moses was up on the mountain, right? And he was going to take out the whole nation. So, and Moses was like, "Yo, if Think you take it. them out, take me out too." Think That's about what Moses it. Said. Think no, about Moses it. did not say that. Moses said, "These motherfuckers." Think about it, man. And he said, keep them because I, it, I want why them. Why does he only care about it? Live by the law or die by the law. That's what Moses said. Live by the law. Live mean, by the law. Live by the law. 68. Or not. Or not. Or not. Start at verse 67. By Christ alone. No, no, no. That's you what Moses said. That's alone. what Moses said. He already been cut. Yeah, but he man. saved he just, them. He's just going on film. No, no, not me. I mean, God saved them. 1 and 68. I think is, is Israel the only nation on the earth that went into slavery? Are there any other nations that went into slavery? Yeah. Cool. The Irish went into slavery. No. Every nation went into slavery. We're talking about ancient nations. Yeah, ancient nations. Every nation went into slavery. So, the, so Moab, you know Moab? Or the Amorites, they go in slavery? Canaan, man. Canaanites, did they go in slavery? Those, are, those, those, were, those they were the go ones in, who bred with the demons. Did they go in slavery? They bred with demons. Did they go into slavery? Uh, no. Who, well, why? Actually, did Jews any other nation go into slavery? slavery? Actually, they did. But any other nation go into slavery? At that point? Yeah. At any believe. point. Well, yes. I believe okay. The, the Most High God saved them out of that slavery. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Where does it say that? Huh? It says it in, in, in the New Testament. What does it say? It says all those who were slaves. You got killed by his own people. It talks about the slaves. He didn't it save them out of free. slavery, though, man. He still saved them. He slaved all those out of slavery because he didn't about this life. You were all enslaved in this life. You and you still are, man. Read this. Uh, all in slavery, man. Luke 1 verse 68. We're enslaved to him until he comes. Yeah, no. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. Wait, hold on. Start at verse, start at verse 67, up, man. man. I love y'all. Luke 1 verse 67. <laughs> and his father Zacharias was filled with the Holy Ghost and prophesied, saying, This is John the Baptist's father. Blessed John be the Baptist's father. I wrote a song about it. Okay, he probably, now John the Baptist, hold up, hold up, hold up. John the Baptist's father prophesied something. Now go ahead. Blessed be the Lord God of Israel. Who of who? 
God of Israel. Okay. Well, now we know what God we're talking about. Go ahead. For he hath visited and redeemed his people. Who people? His people. Now he's talking about when Jesus Christ was born. So who did he redeem? His people. What does redeem mean? The word redeem comes from re, wait, hold on, re meaning again and deem meaning to buy back or to take. So if you redeem somebody, it means you're taking them again, like into saving them. Exactly. The heathens cannot be redeemed because they were never once the most high's people. Right. Go ahead. You can't go against that, man. Think about it. Think about it. Redeem. And has no raised up in a horn of salvation for us in, in the house. That again. <laughs> Blessed be the Lord God of Israel, for he hath visited and redeemed his people, and have raised up in a horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David. Who is that talking about? He's talking about Jesus Christ. The horn of salvation. Right? Have ra had raised up a horn of salvation for up uh, for us. Raised up a horn of salvation for us. Yes, his people <laughs> in the house of David, talking about Jesus Christ. Go ahead. Who is the us? The us is Israel, man. Yes. Go ahead. Christian, Baptist. Go ahead. Hold on. Go ahead. And had raised up in a horn of salvation for us in the house of his servant David, as he spake by the mouth of his holy prophets. Which have been since the world began. Right? Wait, 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 wait. Where's the holy? Wait, wait, wait. It says, as he has spoken. Since the world began. Wait, hold on. Who, who it says, first, who as, the wait, 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 wait. I don't know. There's it only says, people in the world. as he has spoken only two that started. by his holy prophets. What do you mean there was only two? Give me the book. Of, give me the. Yes. Hold on. I want you to give me the book of Isaiah, man. Isaiah? Yeah. 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 There, yeah. Were there two that started the world? Two human beings. Well, I'm the bridge to one right now. You believe there were more than two? Isaiah. I said, believe that's what it says. What do you mean? Isaiah chapter 8. Adam and Eve. Right? Two witnesses are coming like, 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 which is you? Cool. I'm having a good time. You're, so you would probably be Judah. I'm definitely Judah. Okay. I'm not Judah. Definitely. Not ju okay. Well, yeah. You. Yeah, definitely a Negro category. Okay. Well, you would probably be Judah. That's one witness, and the other witness is what we call the Northern Kingdom, which would be the Native American and Hispanics. All right. The two, the two kingdoms of Israel are the two witnesses, Northern and the Southern Kingdom. I don't know if you're familiar with that. All right. After David reigned, just to break it down really quick, after David reigned, Osai tore the kingdom of Israel into two, which was the northern kingdom, which were these tribes. You know, you know what the thing is like? Every tribe my, my under them. That's, that's the northern kingdom. And then you had the southern kingdom, which were these three tribes. They split to two. Those are the two witnesses. Yeah, I see Jesus. It's not two actual people, but two. Yeah, well, well, two kingdoms. Yeah, yeah, the nation of Israel. Yeah. So that's who the two witnesses in Revelation. What do I you want more information? Oh. No, I've almost drowned three different times, and I've seen the white light. I know. Hold on, I'm the case, man. You know, no, no. All Negroes are Judah. Now, well, the Negroes that came on the slave trade, but true, we came from the Nigeria and places like that. So that's the one. Yeah, because the Israelites migrated from Israel to North Africa and ultimately down to um, what is that, West Africa. But then the so-called white man came and brought us over here in slavery. Not all came, but most of us came over here. So yeah. I literally told my wife. Is that true? No. Yes, in fact, that's just... Fucking English. Where does the white man come from? They were white, right? Uh, fucking white. Most of them know where. But they were white, though, right? Yeah, fuck them. So he said, you know who the English are? They rode the Antichrist. They rode with the devil. Most of them are white. Okay? He was the Antichrist. What does that mean? The Antichrist that rolls against Christ alone and against the children of Israel. That's what they are. They're born into slavery. That's who they do. That's what they do all day long, every day. The Euro, every freaking thing in Europe has the mark of the beast. The woman riding the beast. Every monument in England. The mark of the beast. 
Yeah, that's who they roll. They roll with it. They brought it to America. It made it what it is. Anybody is who's not of that. Yeah, man. That's in the book of Revelation. Yeah, but how soon do you think it's really going to be? stands alone. I mean, I don't know, but it's, it's, it got to be sometime soon because they starting to push it out. It was in the Obama health care plan. You know where I'm from right now? Yeah, so that, that just came act, that came active in March. Nah, he's not in Israel. His people is from Kenya. The county? Israel is not really in Kenya, man. Mainly West Africa and um, man, different parts of the world, but mainly West Africa. And then in the United States, according to the the people that lost tribes, the only one of the African Americans, the lost tribes in the Bible. Yeah. Yeah. I'm talking about that. Wrong, I doubt I'm dead. Um, after uh, when they took sins. the walk for yeah. like 40 days. Oh yeah, that's Egypt. Yeah. Egypt. Yeah. But that that's not a prophecy for the day though. That's not okay. Okay. No, the prophecy for the day is Revelation chapter 12. You read Revelation chapter 12. It tells you that um, I think it was a dragon that's gonna persecute the um. Yo, give me Revelation chapter twelve. We gonna go into something else, man. My head, but I know. Revelation chapter twelve. All hell, all hell means is separation from God. Where is that at? There's something nowhere in the Bible. I thought it very um. You know, talks about it in Isaiah. Talks about it in the Psalms. Talks about Start of verse three. three. Yeah. It is. It is. Wait, no, start of verse, start of verse one. If you die, ain't God everywhere? And there appeared a great wonder in heaven, a woman clothed with the sun and the moon under her feet, and upon her head a crown of twelve stars. Right, this woman represents Israel, okay? The twelve stars on her head represents the children of each tribe of Israel. There's twelve tribes of Israel. Go ahead. And she being with no child, cried like travailing, no, in birth, none that seek the pain God. to be delivered. That, 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 right? Go oh, ahead. She's going to deliver the Savior of Israel, which is what they call Jesus Christ. His right. name is Yahweh Shai in the Hebrew. Already said. Go ahead. He said that no now, there appeared another wonder in heaven, and behold, a great red dragon, having seven heads and ten horns and seven crowns upon his head. This dragon represents. By faith alone. It represents America. In the Abraham EU. Okay. Go ahead. Ready to kill his son. And his tail drew the third part of the stars of heaven. The third part of the stars of heaven. Third part meaning three. Which would be Judah, Benjamin, and Levi. Which we call them the dark Israelites. Which would be the Negroes, the West people that live in the West Indies. Right. And the so called Haitians. When it said he drew the third part, meaning he took them and put them into slavery. Alright. Going back to when we were in slavery. It did cast him to the earth. It did cast him to the earth. The earth, the dust in the earth represents a state of confusion or a lower state. Go ahead. And the dragon stood before the woman which is ready to be delivered for to devour her child as soon as it was born. We're talking about Jesus Christ. The dragon right here is going into, um, what's his name? Um, Herod. Herod was trying to kill Jesus Christ when he was born. That's what this is going into. Go ahead. And she brought forth the man child who was to rule all nations with the rod of iron. Right. We, he's going to skip down for the sake of time. Go to verse 15. Wait, wait, go to verse 14. And to the woman were given two wings of a great eagle. Right. That she might flee into the wilderness. This wilderness represents Africa. Now, we know it. Africa was called the land of Ham. It was also known as the wilderness to the Hebrews. Now, in the time of, what was it, 90 uh, BC? I think 70, 70, 70 AD. 70 AD, I'm sorry. 70 AD. The general Vespasian came down and besieged Israel. Now, when the general came down to besiege Israel, all the Israelites flee to North Africa, which would be like Carthage, places like that. But then you had the Punic Wars, what happened. That, that made them go down and flee down to West Africa. Okay, but ultimately said that they were in Africa. Go ahead. 
the son of Joseph, that she might flee into the wilderness right. into her place I'm, I'm always, I'm in where she is nourished for a time and times and a half a time from the face of the serpent. Right, that place life. is in America for a time and a half a time. That's going into when we were in slavery. And the serpent cast out of his mouth water as a flood after the woman that he might cause her to be carried away on the flood. This water represents philosophies and lies. Now, you say you're from Nigeria, right? Um, is it the Ibos? The Ibos? Okay, I know. I know the Ibos. No, but I the I Ibo. told me Ibo. I'm, I'm yeah. the Ibo. No, the Holy Spirit. The Ibo. The English actually knew that they were Israelites. Throughout the whole world. They actually came. I wish I had my book. I don't have it though. It's called um. It's called um. I think it's called From Israel to Exile or something like that. Hebrew Exile. You can buy it on Amazon. Israel to Exile. It's called. I think it's called um. <laughs> I think it's called it's some exile, ex, some exile in Ibo, Ibo, Ibo. That's what it's called. Yeah. I mean, I'm a, I'm Ibo, right? Yeah. Yeah. Ibo exile. It's I mean, called Ibo exile. You, you got it? I don't have it. it. Oh you. yeah, pull it up. Yeah, when you go into that book, it said that the English actually knew that the so-called Ibo were Israelites. So they said what they had to do was they had to tell, make them believe that they weren't the Israelites anymore so that they can spread Christianity. It actually goes into that in the book. So, so still wrote, so I should still read the Bible. I'm rolling out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though they kind of changed the Bible. You should still read it, but you gotta go into the Bible and research, like going to the Hebrew, the Greek, to really understand it. Like a lot of people think that, you got the book? Yeah, the book. That's the book right there. That's interesting to read. That's a cool little book, man. It's called, uh, let me write it like Ibos, yeah, I-B-O-S. Hebrew exiles from Israel. Exiles from Israel. Thank you, brothers. Yeah, so the reason I brought that book out is because the reason I mention that is because what the scriptures say. Read that again. About the flood. And the serpent cast out of his mouth water as a flood after the woman that he might cause her to be carried away of the flood. Now remember this woman represents Israel. The flood represents the lies that he, you know, he basically pushed out on us. Oh, you're not Israelites, you're African. You're, oh, you're supposed to go into slavery because you're the Canaanites. Things like that. Now read, now read what the most I did, go ahead. And the earth helped the woman, and the earth opened her mouth and swallowed up the flood which the dragon cast out of his mouth. Now how could the earth help the woman? How could the earth open up her mouth? It's archaeology. When they dig into the ground and they see the Israelites, Revelation 13. When they open up the earth and they dig into the ground and they see the archaeology, they see stuff like this, man. These are the Israelites coming out of Assyria. You see braids, something like that. Yeah. These are the Israelites. I'm sorry, these are them coming out of the Syria. You see the woolly hair. Yeah. Woolly beard. Oh, Jesus is definitely black. Right, true. Yeah. I, I mean, reading Revelation, he sound black. When you go on, but Be check like it grass. out. Yeah. Yeah. When you go on to it, all the nations that in the ancient day were dark. These are the Elamites of the East Indians. See how dark they are? These are the um, Babylonians. These right here, this is um, this is Babylon too. This right here, wait, hold on, that's the Arab, an Arab. He don't look white to me. No, not at all. Which is cousins to Israel. All right, so all the nations were black, but yes, the Lord was a black man. He was a dark-skinned man. So the white I mean, man, why? So the white man is a Satan. Yeah, he is. He of God, but they just. No, he ain't a God, man. The white man's not a God. I mean, look at his works, man. He actually. I wanted to ask. I wanted to ask. I'm not sure about the white man. No, nah, no. Nah. Um. Not all white. Not all white, but. So, 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 so
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I tried, uh, first John chapter 3, verse 8 again. Yeah. First John 3 and 8. I told about the spirit. No, the so-called the so-called white man is not of God. First of all, you gotta look at his actions, man. This man has slaved the whole earth, man. He said you would know them by their works, right? Right. Right, first John 3 and 8. First John 3 and 8. What version of the Bible do you look at? Uh, King James 16 King James. 11. Yep. Yeah. First, first John 3 and 8. It says, He that committed sin is of the devil. For the devil sent it from the beginning. Now what is sin? Yeah, because why? Because we've been living under the wicked. The scriptures say the righteous, yeah, the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the wicked seduces him. Naturally, if you're living in a house of, with a wicked man, you're going to start to pick up his ways. So we've been living over here, so we picked up this man's ways. Normally, our people, we don't go around molesting little kids and shit like that's wicked, man. Look at the Roman Catholic Church. That's supposed to be a church. They molesting little kids. Well, that's that's wicked, man. First of all, man, I'm supposed to be with a man. That's against the law. So that's wicked, man. So yeah, I mean, quite naturally, naturally, Israel is a righteous people. But true, we we've been around the heathens and things like that. We picked up their ways. But yeah, this this man is of the devil, man. This is John chapter 10, verse 44. John 10, 44. I know what that means. I know what that means. Hey man, here's another book. You can type that in too. This is written by one of the people that live in Israel. He found that he found that, that they weren't the real Jews and that the Negroes were. Why does Judah mean Negro? Huh? It doesn't mean Negro. Judah. Okay. It's synonymous with Negro. That's what they call the Judites today. Oh, for real? Yeah. That's not cool. I'm no, what it's saying is if you if they call you a Negro today, then you're a Judah. Okay. That's just what the, that's the names that our that's the names that our conquerors put on us. Alright man. What do you follow? What do you follow? I never saw you yet. So when I walk past way, I got stopped. Just uh, be out here. You can you can come check us out if you, if you don't want to. You know, I know what you, follow. you can um. I believe, I believe the black side. Okay. Hey. Look into it. I'm not reading the Bible. Hispanic and Native. I'm not reading the Bible because I don't like. Yeah, yeah. So I stop reading. Something, but see that's what I'm saying. Read it, but I just need to keep it. Look into it. If you want to, I'll tell you what to do. Go on our, you got our page. Go on our page, watch the video. You can hit us up, we'll hit you up with more information. And it's up to you, it's up to you to research it and say, well, are these guys right or are these guys wrong? Uh -huh. I mean, but at least go through the information and, and whether you convince yourself or not, it's up to you. You know what I mean? I'm convinced. Okay. I'm convinced already. I just. I, just, I never got to talk to you because it's always like I always see the videos of New York and never right. like anywhere else. So. No, I'm ready everywhere. Right. That's it. Uh, it looks like my friends are getting arrested. All right, man. man. So, it, was, it was a pleasure. I found by myself. I want to talk to you for like hours. All right, man. Be here. Be easy, man. All right, all right. Yeah, so. You know, what were you saying? Yeah, them the Israelites, man. I'm just reading. I'm reading. I'm sorry. I was reading. Yeah, sure are, man. Yeah, so it's kind of throwing me off. Yeah, you what? Like, well, because well, I've read a lot. Okay. And, and it's got me thrown off. <laughs> Why is well, that? I'm just telling you, I'm an educated human being. Okay. And I've read a lot, and this is throwing me off right now. Why is it throwing you off? What's throwing you off? Uh, 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 is it kind of like? Why are you pushing me? I don't know. You. <laughs> cool. Push someone else. Go away. Push someone what's, you know. what's confusing you about it? What's yeah, throwing you off? We don't know her either. Negative. It's not her. I think she knows you. How do you know my name, Megan? I never said that word in my life. I think she liked you, man. Did I say that word? Did you hear me say nah, that you, word? You didn't say that. You didn't say that. You like him? I don't care if she likes me. She pushed me out of the door. 
Oh, okay. I just not be a part of that. So, so what's the you? No, you can tell you. Oh, hey. I apologize. Sorry. Hey, nice to meet you. Hope you have a good Thanks, night. Matthew. Sweetheart? Huh? God Thanks, bless Matthew, you. Right. All right. Hope you have a great night. God bless you. Yeah, no, I mean that. No, I won't. I'm a very educated person, but I'm drunk. So I'm reading Judah. Oh, definitely. Oh, the Negro. You don't, you don't believe that the Negroes are the Jews? No, but I'm, I'm reading. Okay. Be all right here. North American Indian. Gad. Gad. Yeah. 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 That's the tribal name. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all real. Well, see, I'm not being recorded, am I? Y'all real. Nah, man, you're not recording. Right. So, you're good. All right, so the way it works is, uh, all right, so in the book of Genesis chapter 10, right? Correct. I'm you say you read it a lot, right? That's called, according to people, it's called the Table of Nations, correct? All right, so in that book, they have ancient names, right? Yep. The Bible has ancient names of people. Now today, now today, people don't go by those ancient names anymore. Fair enough. Not even the Ishmaelites, which are over, which is over in the Middle East. So what we did was, we put the biblical name on this side, and we put the modern name on this side so that you can understand. You okay. see what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. So what's that's you, how it is. What's your actual name? Huh? What's your actual name? My name is Karatiza. Karatiza. How's the name you're doing with this? What's your name? My name is Karatiza. I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm not being... Ka? You say Ka? Karatiza. Kara. Karachisa. 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 Okay, cool. We pound. My name is Chris. I pound you up. Don't be afraid to shake my hand. You don't I'm shake clean hands. As a whistle. We're Israelites, so we, we do Israelite things. We don't shake. No, we don't shake. Did they, did they shake you here? I don't even know what that is. It was a Roman custom, like you're shaking you. That affect you. you no, it's just a Roman custom of shaking. Handshaking came from the Romans. It was a sign. Well, other nations use it too. Okay, but it's America is an extension of Rome. It's really not. It is. It is. It's an extension of Rome. Okay, why do you use Roman numerals? I don't. No, why does America use Roman numerals? Because America, America goes off the customs of Rome and Greece. So it's a it's a Roman. That's a stretch. Though. That's a stretch. Not a stretch. I don't see that happen very often. Yeah, what do you mean? Yeah. I'm an IT guy. Wait, hold on. And you, well, 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 okay. Well, I'm an IT guy. Okay. Well, let's. Well, I don't let's, see Roman numerals very often. Well, let's talk then. When you go into classification here, wait, hold on. And be respectful. When you go into and, and, and I'm not trying to fuck with you. Hold on. I promise you, in my life. We just want to talk. I just want to learn and I want to be educated. Okay. I want to know. We're gonna educate you then. Listen. Right. When you go into no, no, no. Come over here. I don't mean to be behind. No, 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 no. Come over here. We got camera out there. We're not recording. The camera is facing right, me. Fair enough. That's what I was. Now listen. About. When you go into when you go into classification of things, whether it be whether it's animals, Fair enough. chemicals, or things like that, even a periodic table, Fair enough. it's written in Latin. Latin goes back to I know Rome. I know. So America is an extension of Rome. The, your alphabet goes back to Latin. Agreed. Latin letters. Agreed. So well, then America. Okay, does. well your customs go back to Rome and Greece. Every language. Even does. your democracy. But every language does. No. Yes. No, I'm, it's outside not. of Asian. No. Chinese. China. Mandarin. That's Asian. Man, okay, well, let's go with Arabic. Does that go back to Rome and Greece? They just want to kill everybody, so. I'm talking, we're talking about, about, about their language. Their I language. Agree, I agree with you. Their I'm language goes back to Hebrew. No, it does not. Yes, it does. Do you know what the word Malik? Oh, no, you said Arabic. I thought Arabic. was talking Asia. Yes, you're Arabic. Right. Arabic goes back to Hebrew. So American, correct, American correct, language correct. of English goes back to Latin, which is which was the language of Greece. I'm, I'm sorry, the language of Rome. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna so, call a pause. I'm gonna ask you as a friend. My name is Chris. I met you. I forgot about that. So what is, what is it you're doing right now? What is it we're doing? Yeah, I want to know here, what you're like accomplishing. We're, what are what we accomplishing? What is your goal right now? We're teaching right. our people, the nation of Israel. What is our, our people? Yasharala. The people on this sign. Okay, so I'm just being cool. 
Okay. Love everybody. I'm a very chill person. What are you talking about today? No, no, I'm being sincere. No, no, cool. What is accomplishing this right now? What is accomplishing this? Yes. What are we accomplishing? Please. You see this camera right here? Yes, we put sir. this up on YouTube to teach the people of Israel or Yasharala, the Negroes, Native but, Americans, but teaching them and his, what? to teach them the truth about who they are and about their Savior and about okay. their God. So, so, who they are? Who are they? The tribe of Judah are the Negroes. They came over to America on slave ships. Oh, I know about that. Okay. The tri spaceships? Slave ships. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I thought you said yeah, spaceships. Yeah. Slave <laughs> like, ships. Now it just got weird. According to Deuteronomy chapter 28, verse 68. No, I know that. Okay. I know that happened. I know okay. that happened. So, my point being, I want to have a, just an educated conversation with you. So, I not educated. I know that happened. I know that happened. We can have a conversation in wisdom, but not education. Education deals with its well, the yeah. education in the United States is a failure of life. Right. Okay. Fair enough. I would agree right. With that. No, man. This. But well, education means that this country. Education, education is a joke. The word education it's means to joke. teach in a skill. It means man. learn shit you don't need to learn. It means learn to teach you how to work. Life. We're on the same page there. Okay. So go ahead. But what I, my question is, what is, what is your accomplishment? It's, it's Saturday night. Mm -hmm. You're a young man. How old are you? Right. I'm 30. All right, I'm 40. Okay. So my, my cure... Go ahead. Give us a second. So I'm, you're a young man to me. Okay, yeah, no I'm disrespect. young. No disrespect. I am no young. No disrespect. No, true. What is your... What do you accomplish here? Yes. Thank you. You hear me. You hear Isaiah me. chapter 15. Don't be mad at me. Don't be mad at me. Please Isaiah. don't be mad at me. No, man. I'm actually Second in Second 15 and 1. Reason. Isaiah 58. It's fun for me. I ain't mad. Isaiah 58 and 1. Cry aloud, spare not. Lift up thy voice like a trumpet and shoo my people their transgressions. So you're reading from the Bible, yes? Yes. In the house of Jacob. Okay, so I've read the Bible wait, hold on. three times. Wait, wait, wait. One more. One more. Second Nudges 15, so we can let you know what we out here accomplishing. Well, he's looking. 15 and 1. He got it. He got it. Go ahead. Be look at what say. Be Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Read, read, read. Speak thou in the ears of my people the word of prophecy which I will put in thy mouth said the Lord right I don't know any part of that so go ahead we Let's just call you me out here just to make sure we're not in a mix of our bullshit we told you while we was out here so what's your point what you was about to say well I just want to make sure I'm not going to get punched no you're not going to get punched my thing is I've read the Bible three times and you know I'm just I'm going okay and the thing that I pulled out of the Bible most was don't preach don't preach. Hey. Don't preach. Jesus said, don't preach. He said that. It's in the Bible. I can't tell you. I can't. You talking about Judge not? I can't flip the book and tell you where. I'll give you that. So you guys are, you know, you got me on that. But I do know he said don't preach. So you so say the what thing we out here doing is wrong? No. Okay, go ahead. What I'm asking you is if the actual person you're following said, be you, do you think, but don't preach, don't push. What is it? Are, are, are you following him? Or have, you, or have you come up with your own thing that you're so passionate about that you lost sight of I'm what? I'm tell you something. Have you lost sight of what this is? No, because we just gave you two scriptures that said that we're commanded. I heard, I heard, I heard. Okay, well, we're commanded to come out and teach. It's like but he didn't do that. He did do that. No, he didn't. He walked in sandals. And he taught. No, but he didn't preach. He did preach. People followed him because they wanted to. He did not. First of all, he was hated. Why? If you were teaching love and you were you weren't preaching and pushing, agreed, agreed, agreed. why would people hate you? Agreed. Because well, he, he were preaching condemnation to them. He didn't come out on a Saturday night. He you walked mean? to the people that needed to be healed. He healed. Did he not go up into the mountains and and, and, and tell and No, that teach? was Moses. No, no, Jesus that was Christ Moses. did. Did he not go into the temple and read out of the book of Isaiah and Jeremiah? Moses. I give you that. But Moses went to the mountains. He 
Well, it was a hill. Mount 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 it wasn't enough bread. And by and the you way, made I just want you know, I love you. Okay. I'm, 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 I forgot well. about the days. I'm a happy person, okay. and I want this world to get better. And I don't want you to it think will. I'm. I don't want you to think I'm being like deflective of what you're doing, or or negative about it. I want all this bullshit to go away. This well, is ruining this world. It is gonna go away. No, no, it's ruining this world, and I agree with you. The only thing I'm worried about. What's your nationality, if I can ask you? Oh, it don't matter. It does. You know what? I don't have a nationality. Where do you, you know what my your, nationality is? Where's your father love. from? I'm love. Me That's your ethnicity. Like, where, well, where, you, I mean, where you small from? I was born in Connecticut. Where's my, your father? My, my mom, dad, they're mixed. Every race mixed. Means that they come from the Middle East? Well, my mom is half black. You say you love, right? No, my mom. Yeah, absolutely. So everybody should get together? Agreed. My mom is half I'll black. Y'all about she hey, my mom is half black. She's dead. God bless her. I love her. I miss her. Yeah. My mom's half black. Oh, she's girl, she's gone. Girl, so. She's gone. My dad. You know he's whatever. He's not a good person. I'm sorry about that. You know what we were teaching about tonight, man. We was teaching about how the philosophy philosophy of this world that everybody should get together. I could not agree with you, Mark. Well, but listen, but listen. Why don't you shake your hand once? Because I don't shake hands. But listen, my hand is clean that's, as the a whistle. that's the philosophy. Yeah, why, do you, why do you want to shake hands so bad? Because, because. Think about it. You well, want to be a actually, actually, no disrespect, but you think about it. If we're all about love and peace and being friends, you can't touch my fucking hand. But that's not what I'm we're not about. That's not what we're that's about. What, we're about. Oh, what? So you're not about love. We're and separatists. Peace. So you're not about love and peace. We're, we're about love and peace. Well, but, then, but, but why is my hand dirty? But I didn't say your hand was dirty. But well, we're about why, it. Why won't you touch it? Because that's not my custom. Why? Why do I have to submit why to your we, custom? It's a submission. <laughs> it's not. My, it's not my custom. Submission? It's not that my is custom. the weirdest thing you said to me. Yeah, well, sent to my sin. Yeah, but that's you what you're China, doing. If you go to China and submission? do that, mission, you, you're trying to make yeah, me but submit I'm not to your from custom. China. You're trying to make me submit to your custom. I'm really? not. That's not my custom. If you used to go to, if you used to go to China, you have to bow your head. Man, they wouldn't want you to shake your hand. I've been to China. And you had to bow your head. I'm not so you don't bow your head. You don't no. bow. Why? Why? Because that's not your custom. And you won't you. submit to that you, custom. Man. So what's your custom? I just told we you. Just, we just been doing it. You're right. Time. You're right. But I want to hear it again. We'll pound your hand. I'll, I'll pound you up. But that's what's it. your custom? I just told you. Tell me one more time, please. I'll pound you up, but we don't no, shake no. hands. Not about pounding. What's your custom? We're Israelites. Which means we're Yasharala. Which means we're the prince of the power. I'm gonna say it one more time, not rudely, because you're still saying shit I don't know about. Which means we're the children of God. We're the chosen okay, people so of God. Would God shake my hand? No, he probably wouldn't. <laughs> you're wrong. He has. If God, if God shook your hand, you'll drop dead, man. man. If you even seen his face, that. you'll drop I give dead. That. I give he you wouldn't that. shake your hand. Hold on, I give you He's that. He's a king. Why would he I'm submit to you? Can we turn this camera around? I want this on video. Nah, this is kind of fun. Nah. I no, mean, because you, you can't, we're having an educated serious. conversation. But you can't expect me to submit to your customs. You can't be talk to me. I ask you to submit. You came to talk to me as one If you brother. come talk to me, I then you have you, to submit to on, my on, customs. On, 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 on. Yeah. I ask you one brother to another. Drunk, drunk, man. I'm not actually drunk. You, are, you just said you were drunk. <laughs> yeah, you drunk, man. <laughs> hey, man. I'll yeah. praise y'all about Shimmy Out Shot, double honors to the elders, great millstone. Uh, uh, peace and blessing to the brothers out there. I'm just saying. Yeah. You How see what the most I bring, the, the most I showing you here the custom of the world is that they want everybody to be one people. The most I don't want is so. The most I showed that all night. So with that, we say y'all about Shimmy Out Shot, Brock is Shalom, Mark. I've actually sobered up today.